and put your hands together for Gianfranco Fregarino. Go! Good evening and thanks to be here. Well, first of all, I would like a big round of applause for my two helpers. Thanks to be here. Yeah. Thanks. Thank well, as you heard, my name is Gianfranco. I'm Italian, but no problem because I can speak English without accent. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean without English accent. <laughs> well, to start, I need your imagination because without it, I can't use these cards, since they have been printed with the back on both sides. <laughs> so we have just backs here, and also on the other side, just back. <laughs> but with imagination, I can picture, for example, this is the Queen of Spades. Yeah, check it. It's a double back card, yeah? Open it. Check, yeah. Of course, I said. <laughs> <laughs> but. <laughs> With imagination, for me, this is the queen of spades. And I have to put it away because it could be in danger. And also the other queens are in danger, so you have to remove them. So, oh, queen of clubs. Uh, huh? uh, <laughs> queen of hearts. <laughs> uh, really? And uh, yeah, queen of diamonds, yeah. Um, queens are in danger because the jokers. Jokers are very dangerous for the queens, so I have to remove also the jokers and oh, oh, this is a strange situation. Yeah, four jokers in the deck, it's a very dangerous situation for the queens. And maybe you can recognize the jokers from this side or this side, say yes. Yes. yes fantastic. <laughs> well, but for those of you who cannot recognize the cards, I just wave my hand and now Jokers wow. are <laughs> visible. Thank you. But not only, also all the cards. And these are exactly the queen of clubs, hearts and diamonds. But that car, remember, a few moments ago, you cannot recognize the queen of space. And it's still here on the table. Please, turn the card. And exactly the, the queen of space. Well, thank you very much. Now I have to explain why jokers are dangerous for the queens and also by using imagination. It's because jokers eat the queens. So in my imagination, jokers are cannibal cards. Look at this, for example. It seems funny, smiling as the others, but isn't. And uh, if uh, jokers represent the cannibals, the queens represent the missionaries. It's correct, missionaries, yeah? Yeah. And uh, among the missionaries, there is the mother superior. And there's no clubs. No. Yeah, the queen of space. Yeah. And let's suppose this is a bus in the street. At one point, the queen of space decides to get off the bus, and the other three must follow her. And the bus leaves. So the joker Jokers see the queens and assume the classic yum yum position. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and they capture the first and chew, listen the bones. And digest. And that's why we still have four cars only. Of course, just the four jokers. But it's not time to celebrate yet because they stay hungry. So. They capture a second queen, and one more time they chew, and the bones, and now, yes, celebration time with the infamous cannibal dance. <laughs> uh, it seems cannibalism is quite dietary. In fact, if you see, they are very slim and nothing more inside. Wow. Well, now, Ah, the queen of space is captured for last because she's not stupid. She said to the other, you go first. <laughs> and one more time, the chew and the bones and the infamous cannibal dance for just one, two, three, and four jokers. 
But now is the time of the queen of spades. And at this moment, the boss returns. And the queen of spades takes the opportunity to rise aboard, to escape, of course. But the jokers follow her and grab her by the handcuff and drag her out the bus. I, I have to put this straight, otherwise they might choke. <laughs> and one more time, the chew and the bones and the infamous cannibal dance for just one, two, three, and four cars. Thank you. <laughs> Philosopher Feuerbach said, man is what he hits. If that is true, now the four jokers become the four queens. <laughs> I can check it exactly the four queens. You can check the. Yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> well, in reality, jokers are not vanished. In reality, one is here, another one is here, a third one is here, and the last one is here. <laughs> Thank you. And I have to put them away for the safety of the queens, of course. And uh, now it's time to find a selected card. But I will do in a very difficult way. So three cards together. And for this, I need three helpers. For example, you and you, of course. And you, it's not important for you to help me. OK, stay, stay, no problem. Um, <laughs> look, I run the cards in this way. You have to tell me now and say, stop. You have to tell me stop, and uh, when you tell me stop, I will take the first three cards from here, okay? So, okay. it's up to you. Stop. One more, two more. Four more. Eh? Four more? Four. One, two, three, and four. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, for you, and for you, and for you. So, look at it. Remember, a show the car to the people around you. Fantastic. Put the card face down on the table. And now we have, we have to choose three different spots in the deck. So you have to tell me stop on the top part, you in the middle part, more or less, of course, and you on the bottom part of the deck. So tell me stop. Stop. OK. And remember, OK? And you too, tell me stop where you want. And remember, you also tell me stop where you want. Here? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and remember, okay? So, three different cards and three different spots in the deck. Now it's very difficult, right? And for this, uh, I have to use the classic uh, countdown strategy. The so-called candle strategy. Yeah, uh, you knock on down three, two, one, zero. Look, one, two, three, <laughs> one, two, one, zero. Voila, deck is ready. <laughs> and now I can find your cards by using logic. For example, for the card number one, one cut. <laughs> I hope. Uh, please name your card. Three of clubs. Three of clubs. Yeah, the three of clubs. Yeah. But. For the card number two, two cuts. So one and two. <laughs> Name your card. Five of diamonds. And the five of diamonds, yeah. <laughs> but try to guess. For the card number three, how many cuts? Three cuts. <laughs> <laughs> I love my job. Okay. <laughs> one, two. And three, I hope. Name your card. Jack of hearts. The jack of hearts. Ladies and gentlemen, the jack of yeah. hearts. Yeah. But maybe some of you are thinking, hey, he can cast out any cards, for example, so the ace of spades. You like ace of spades? Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> ace of spades. <laughs> and without looking, and without looking, I hope. Uh, the ace of spades, okay. <laughs> but for a poker player, ace of spades is a very good card, but are better the four aces. Yeah. 
Thank you. Well, now it's time to show how a cheater can stack the four aces for himself in a four-end poker game and in a very fast way. And for this, two aces need to be on the bottom and the other two on the top in a very fast way. Look. It's not too fast. No. Okay. <laughs> And believe it or not, it's done. Yeah, i show you. <laughs> and the variant of poker I use is the so-called stud poker. Do you know stud poker? It's when the first card is dealt face down and the others face up. So I can see a jack, a nine, a seven, and one ace for me. <laughs> and a four, a two, a king, and a second ace for me. <laughs> it's interesting, yeah? <laughs> And a seven, a five, and so on. And the third ace. Yeah. And look, clubs, diamonds, hearts, the ace of spades remains. So if I did the last card to every player, it's a rise to me, ladies and gentlemen, the ace of spades. Thanks. <laughs> well, no, I have to explain. In Italy, this is called ace of spades. <laughs> <laughs> No, okay. If all the players can see the four aces in my hand, nobody bets money. So I have always to hide the last ace in the hole. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> but the meaning of this is not very important, knowing the whole cards of the other three players. And let's suppose the other three players are more than you, you and you. It's not important, but let's suppose. For me, knowing your whole cards is very easy. Because one more time, your three of clubs. One more time is your five of diamonds. And of course, your jack of hearts. Thank you. Well, uh, people usually say, lucky at cards, unlucky in love. I don't believe it. I think instead there's much love in the deck of cards. And if you remember at the beginning and consider cards as human beings, remember candy balls. <laughs> okay. And um, now, now I'm going to do the same. And let's suppose these are 52 people in looking for their soulmate. And for a card, the soulmate is the other card with the same value and color. For example, the soulmate of the five of hearts is the five of diamonds, of course. And as we know, as we know, it's difficult to find our soulmate because in the life we are separated by from other people, maybe by the borders between the countries, and we have to mix with others. Uh, please check the carcase that is normal and empty, please. Okay, and look the shuffle is not complete yet. So you have to complete the shuffle by squaring the cards in this way. And also on the other way. Fantastic. And please put the squared packet inside the card case and close the card case. Very well done, very well done. And you too, look, look at the shuffle. It's not complete. You have to complete with me the shuffle. Do it, do it. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> now, you have to find one, you have to choose one of the first of four or five cards. One of, one of this. The two of diamonds. Okay, take it face, uh, face up and tell me stop where you want. Stop. Okay. Here, so you decided for the two of diamonds and the spot in the deck. So, now I have to have the two of diamonds in finding its soulmate, and how we do with a classic song of universal love. But just in my mind, just in my mind. <laughs> okay. I know it seems ridiculous, but it works, I hope. In fact, thanks to the song, the two of, <coughs> of diamonds find its soulmate. Thank you very much. Uh, well, and uh, now I will try with two cards. So look, here uh, you have a nine and a queen, here a five and a jack. Which card do you prefer, nine and queen or five and jack? Nine and queen. Nine and queen, okay. So uh, a red nine and a black queen. And as we know, it's difficult to find our soulmate because rarely we go in the same direction of the other people. Sometimes we go in different direction. Sometimes in opposite direction. 
and also the cars do that. And this creates chaos in the world. And it's difficult in the chaos recognize the soulmate, is, you know, for example, for example. But with the song in my mind, <laughs> now all the cars are in the same direction. The cows disappear. And without the cows, it's easier to recognize the soulmates. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, oh, sorry. It's not good to find the soulmates and put them away. It's a cruel action. <laughs> okay. And well, I will try with three cards and during an open shuffle in this way. Oh, let me check. Maybe I already saw Mr. Gerd. No, no. Okay. <laughs> and um, okay. And continue in this way. And you, please, before the last card, you have to tell me now three times. And every time I will put here, face up, the card in my right hand. Mm -hmm. Okay? So, three times. Now. Oh. <laughs> Hate of space. The Tang of Diamonds. No. And the Nine of Space. Thanks. So, three cards decided by you during an open shuffle. Now it's very difficult, right? And maybe, maybe, just in my mind isn't enough. Maybe I have to sing the song for real. <laughs> <coughs> it's a very popular song, okay? <coughs> so, all you need is love. Pa -pa -la -la -la. The most important part is pa -pa -la -la. <laughs> but the real important thing is the nine of spades, ten of diamonds, and eight of spades that I hope found their soulmates. Thanks, thanks. But maybe they are here, one or two or three couple of kindred souls already together. So let me check. They are soulmates? No. Okay. <laughs> they are soulmates? They are soulmates? No. But I'm still hoping for that, okay? They are soulmates? Mm -mm. Huh. They are soulmates? No. No. Oh. They are soulmates? No. Oh. They are soulmates? No. No. Oh, there are so many. <laughs> La last chance. No. Oh, that's very sad. <laughs> An entire world of lonely souls. But I can sing. <laughs> so, all you need is love. Ba -ba -la -la -la. Oh, thanks for your help. <laughs> because with your help, now here we have. Uh, the two red queens, the two red wow. fives, wow. the red jacks, and now look, wow. all the cars are exactly in couples. Thank you very much. Thank you. Oh, oh, oh. no, no. Because maybe some of you are thinking, hey, I don't believe in the power of song. I think it's, that is just by skill. But if you remember, there's a bunch of cars that you shuffle square, they put inside the car case. And I never touch them from that. <laughs> but I can sing. <laughs> so, all you need is love. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I love my job. <laughs> Here. Exactly. The two black sixes. And the red trees. And the kings. And now, every card found its soulmate. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you for your help. Thank you for your help. Thank you. Well, thank you. Have a good night. Have a good life. And ciao. Thank you. Yes. Encore. <laughs>